Yeah, um, I'm Macro and I'm front-end developer and I play improv since six years and I discover a lot of similarities between both and that's really interesting because I choose uh, improv uh, as a hobby because I want to do something outside a computer. That was really, that was the intention and uh, it don't work. Uh, because, yeah, I love both and I bring it together. That's uh, the idea. So can I ask you um, how many of you have seen an improv show? Oh, a lot. That's cool. Um, so for all the others, I explain it a little bit, what we do. We, um, we have no script for a complete show. So it can be a short a uh, form show, so that is a lot of short scenes, or it can be really a long play, and we don't know what happens. That's the thing. We have nothing on a stage. It's really, it's blank. It's only two chairs, and yeah, we normally are a group, and maybe you don't know each member of the group as well, so you play with strangers. And um, so there's really a lot of unknown things. And yeah, so what we have to do is, uh, is a lot. And this a lot means that we are actors. So we are the writers of that all together as a team. So we are kind of the sound engineers. We kind of uh, make the dramaturgy. So that everything looks great on stage. And um, yeah, we are the directors. And yeah, everything without no script is maybe impossible. And, uh, but we do it and we do it in a mostly really cool way. And uh, uh, in the end, it's kind of magic. It is. Uh, it comes out of nothing and it turns into magic. It's, and it's a little bit like programming. So, um, yeah, and how we do that? Um, we have rules. So that's, uh, that's the main part. And uh, if you start learning improv, uh, you start learning some basic rules. And, yeah, um, I think uh, a lot of that rules also fit in your work life. That's, that's the idea I want to show you today. Yeah, first rule is say yes. That's uh, one of the main things improvisers say. Um, that means you have to accept what other um, improvisers say on stage. If they say something, then it is real. So. Um, if your partner says, I'm your father, then it is my father. If I say, no, you are my sister, then it don't work. So it's really simple. And that's the yes part. And the end part is uh, I add some additional thing on it. So he's my father. Hey, father, we have seen each other since the 90s. What? And so you have uh, starting a story. And um, so we build the story together. And the cool thing is, if you build something together, everybody is in that moment and in that story. And they know what to do. And same thing is uh, as a programmer in, in your office. If you have um, maybe an, an task and and ask people what to do and you, you should accept things and add another thing to it. So um, you create that together and you don't need um, to, to ask for acceptance after that because you do it together. And that's, that's kind of interesting. And we uh, 
do it in my company a lot with uh, also with the users. So we ask the users um, really on a really early stage for feedback, and if they um, bring us feedback, then we put it um, in our product and ask them could we add something like that? And so we we have a really open discussion uh, in the in the first stage. And people are really satisfied um, with us because we ask them. And uh, also that we ask people is, uh, is really a nice uh, thing in improv theater because uh, we ask the audience all the time about give us words, suggestions, uh, make decisions. And so um, people in the audience uh, connect with us because they are also part of the process. And um, yeah, that's kind of uh, interesting similarity, I think. So next, next thing is uh, start positive. Start positive is, sounds really easy, but it isn't. So um, I want to have a little experiment. So um, can you turn to your neighbor and uh, say um, what kind of editor you really like most? And the other person respond really positive about it. So can we do that? And then we turn around. So, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, how how it feels? <laughs> Everybody's talking. That's the way. It is totally interesting, or isn't it? <laughs> and it's and it's so cool. <laughs> that, what have you done? Yeah, chaos. Yes. <laughs> no, that's. I mean, that's the way you see people are interested in each other. And if you are positive and start positive, it's much easier to to talk about topics. And so, start in a meeting. Maybe you know it's a boring meeting, or it's maybe there's a lot of conflict potential in it. Whatever. Start positive. Start bring up a, a nice uh, discussion about it. And uh, it is so much easier and it's so much more productive. And yeah, so try that. It's, it's really a simple trick and um, it's nice. Yeah, well, next thing, kind of a rule is uh, let your partner shine. Let your partner shine is uh, in improv um, the thing because... Um, your partner is the most important uh, person in the whole room. So you have to bring up as a team really important things. So um, you have to have a look. Um, is he com comfortable with um, the situation or she? Um, it's a both gender um, on stage. And um, so that's maybe also a good topic um, if you have some kind of pair programming or so. So let, uh, let the other shine. So bring up uh, some words or some things that uh, people are uh, also on your level so that you don't uh, lose people because maybe you, uh, you are driving in a pair programming and you are so fast and the other don't know really what's going on, then it's not really teamwork. So uh, bring up that and um, it helps. It's, uh, it's much nicer um, to uh, work on a on same level and see um, yeah, that people grow and um, yeah, have also fun with it. Yeah, next uh, big thing uh, and a really hard topic is embrace failure. So it's 10 minutes. Okay. Um, yeah. Um, embrace failure is uh, um, a thing on, on the stage. It's not 
perfect. You listen to a lot of things and you have to do so much. There are kind of mistakes on stage. And um, embrace failure means take that failure as a chance and make it open that you have seen it. So we have, we have a scene uh, in English and um, the, the other actor struggled with English like me a little bit. And we had a scene about a baby and uh, she was clearly pregnant and says, uh, uh, I have a baby in my stomach. And that's, that's strange. And, um, but there, there was really that embrace failure. So we had uh, directly drive her to an uh, to her operation and a lot of things happened to save the baby. And it was really an amazing evening. So um, we, we take that um, failure and uh, make something about it. And uh, that's the same thing in programming. So uh, make, make a mistake and... Yes. <laughs> yeah, and um, yeah. <laughs> and um, it's sometimes it's tough to to say yeah I I was wrong, but in the end it turns positive, but it helps really. So okay, that's a kind of um, introduction in improv and programming. <laughs> We are.